Boston police open fire in Dorchester. We are still waiting to find out why and if anyone was hurt. We're waiting for a news conference at Boston Police Headquarters. WBZ's Tiffany Chan is live there for us on the scene tonight. Tiffany, we know that uh, you were at the scene earlier. You spoke to witnesses. What the, did they tell you? Liam and Paula, we are expecting an update from Boston police within the next hour or so, but here's what we know so far. An active investigation is underway at Pell Hollow Street in Dorchester, the scene of a police-involved shooting. I was there about 45 minutes ago and saw dozens of officers and detectives scouring the area for evidence. Uniformed officers were going door to door, interviewing witnesses, asking them if they heard anything, if they saw anything. Our photographer getting video at the time did see a bicycle on the ground behind that yellow crime scene tape. It's still unclear whether that's a part of the investigation, but we did talk to one bystander who worked up the street. He describes what he heard today. I just heard gunshots, but I thought I thought it was fire. I thought there were fireworks when I first heard them, but I was like I don't know, they're a little bit too fast and too loud to be like fireworks. And then I seen kids running up from the the park. It seems like they was at the park, so I seen kids running, running, running after the uh, gunshots were fired. And there is a separate crime scene set up up the street from the video that you saw on Geneva Avenue near a park. Right now, it's still unclear whether those two incidents are related. We do expect to hear from Boston Police Commissioner William Gross within the next hour or so to get some details on whether anybody was hurt, who was involved, and whether police are looking for anybody. That's the latest from Boston Police Headquarters. I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.